the castaways find Captain Harding, only to discover that he is a prisoner of the volcano people. As Harding is about to be sacrificed in a strange ceremony, his comrades rush to his aid. to save the captain. I owe you my life, Neb. We never expected to see you again. Where have you been all this time? I'm not sure. I'll tell you all about it later when we get into friendlier territory. I have a dim memory of being picked up out of the ocean. But I don't know by whom or what. I felt as though I was being carried somewhere. When I finally revived, I was in that meadow where the volcano people found me. What do you make of them? They're not like anyone I've ever seen or heard of. Neb calls them volcano people. They have some strange way of making fire. Have you seen any other inhabitants? Yes, we have. A strange girl. A girl? She has the appearance of one from another planet. Amazing. This is a volcanic island. It probably rose from the sea during an eruption. And it's possible that some people from an undersea continent came with it. Whoever she is, she's not a friend. She carries a weapon of a kind I've never seen on land or sea. What did it do? It burned a rock nearby. Luckily, it missed us. Oh, some method of protecting an intense heat. I'd like to meet this girl. For my part, you can have her. <laughs> Well, we have food and water. Now I must find some shelter. There's plenty of caves around here, Captain. A good idea. Perhaps our unknown benefactor will furnish it for us. Well, we'll find one. Then we'll stake our claim and decide how we can get away from here. Everyone carry something. Come on, Top. What's here? Now we know where the Earth people will live. Time for a message from our leader. It's all right. 
right, come on in. Looks like somebody's been living here. I wonder who. Maybe the wild man. Let's see where that door leads. Isn't this the bulkhead door of a ship? That's right, sir, it is. Looks like something we can use. Let's see what's in the crate. something you can eat. <laughs> this will keep us alive for a while. I hope we won't have to stay here long. There's some steps to that archway. Well, this part at least is man-made. Let's see where that door leads to. Maybe it's sealed. It looks like it hasn't been used in years. But it has been. Look. We'll hope that footprint was made by Frank. But until we know, this door is a menace to our safety. Meanwhile, let's set up housekeeping until we find out where we are and how we're going to get away. Good idea. should last a month or so. There must be game of some kind on the island. And plenty of fish in the sea. You're right. But we must build a reserve supply of food while we can. We have nature to contend with as well as our human enemies. That's right. See what's wrong, Bert. What's the matter, boy? Hungry? I can see. I guess Top is just hungry. It's running, but it's Washington time. Oh, that's what I want. With this, I can find our longitude. Oh. With a sunny spot and a stick, I can tell when it's noon. Sounds too complicated to me. I think I'd rather go hunting. Go ahead, but don't wander too far. <laughs> well, look what I found. Now I can write a story of a trip. Always the reporter. <laughs> Neb, will you give me a hand? We can make a desk and chair from that stuff in the other room. Find a spot for our calculations.
shadow reaches its shortest point, it'll be noon. The shadow's starting to get longer. We've just passed noon. What time have you? A minute past five, Washington time. Let's see, Washington is about 77 degrees longitude. The sun travels 15 degrees an hour. At, let's uh, see, five hours difference would place us 75 degrees west of Washington. 77 plus 75 is 152. Our approximate longitude west of Greenwich. 152 west. If I know my charts, that puts us well in the islands of the Pacific. Yes. And over 4,000 miles from the American coast. Back to the shack. I'm sorry to have caused you so much trouble. Why didn't you tell us before that you could speak and understand English? Oh, I've been here so long alone, I must have lost my mind. Is that why you attacked me? Yes. Yes, it must have been. How did you come here? I came on a pirate ship. How long ago? I've lost all track of time. Whose hut is this? The pirates built it. But now it's mine. So you were angry when you found us in it? Were you a pirate? No. No. They captured me from a merchant ship. I tried to escape. They marooned me here. You know of any food on the island? Yes. Yes, the pirates stored some here, intending to return for it. Where are these supplies? In a canyon not far from here. Will you show us where they are? Yes. You two go with it. I don't trust him. Neither do I. But Pencroft and Gideon can take care of themselves. There are the supplies. That's an odd place to stow them. Oh, it was done to keep the wild animals from getting them. How do we get to them? I'll show you.
Will this girl from Mercury continue to menace the castaways? Will Ayrton, the wild man, form an alliance with the strange volcano people? Don't fail to see Trail of the Mystery Man, the fifth smashing chapter of Mysterious Island, at this theater next week. The wild man, Ayrton, seeming to regret his recent hostility, offers to show the castaways a hidden supply of food. Pencroft and Gideon accompany him on guard against treachery. Then let's get to safer ground. What happened to the wild man? He cleared out. If we ever see him again, remind me that I owe him something. Well, there's probably a lot here that we can use, but the question is getting it out. Maybe we can use it as a reserve supply. You feel like starting back to the hut? I'm fit. could have made such tracks? I don't know. Do you remember Harding's story of being carried from the water by somebody? Yes. Only a giant could have made tracks like that. Well, who knows? There are many mysterious things on this island that are beyond my understanding. You're right. And except for the huge footprints in the sand, Gideon and I found no other signs of who they belonged to. But we saw all we want of the wild man. Harrington? Yeah. yeah. He's undoubtedly insane. Our problem now is to find a way off this island. Only a boat or a miracle could do that, Captain Harding. Or perhaps our strange mystery man, if we could only locate him. You think he'd help us get away? He's hated us before. We'll start our search for him in that meadow where I first recovered consciousness. Captain, can I go with you? I guess it'll be safe enough. Oh, I'll need you along to help identify footprints, if we find any. I'll stay here. I want to catch up on the notes for my story. You do that, Gideon. Maybe we can bring you back a happy ending. <laughs> this is where we saw you. Then your idea is that he may have a hideout someplace in this area. Yes. We'll spread out and keep your eyes open for anything out of the ordinary.
Captain Harding! Mr. Pencroft, come quick! This may be what we're looking for. Those look familiar to you, Pencroft? They're the same kind of markings that Gideon and I saw. They lead toward those rocks. see any more of those weird prints. Maybe they turned off somewhere behind us. This seems to be a natural path. Let's see where it leads. Take cover till they come within range. Prince must have turned off the trail somewhere behind us. There's somebody up on those rocks. Why, it looks like a girl. She's the one we told you about. Well, our rifles are no match for the strange weapons she's using. Besides, making war on women isn't quite in my line. We haven't much choice. I'm making my choice while I'm still able. I wonder if that girl could have made those huge footprints. It seems impossible. You know, I'm beginning to believe that on this island, nothing is impossible. Well, that girl certainly isn't trying to help us. All she does is shoot fiery blasts at us from that strange gun. Anyhow, we're safe here. But not for long. Stop right there, we'll shoot. They don't understand. I'll fire a shot over their heads. These lovers seem to think we're going to kill them. Maybe somebody's been giving them wrong ideas about us. I think someone has. If we can convince them we mean no harm, they may be willing to help. How can we do that? By returning them to their people unharmed. They came from that direction. You, take us. Too cheap. All right, move. Oh, my pulangi, panga, panga. Papalangi, Sao, Funga. Wonder what he said. Probably telling him about our rifles. I hope he told him how we could have shot them, but didn't. We want to make friends, understand? I think we're being welcomed. We'd better accept. Do you understand? Friends.
Leai, force your call. Leai, Pali Wonga. Le war. Le war. From the expression on the chief's face, he's up to no good. Yes. I think we're being double crossed. But I'm sure we'll find out. Halanga. Toyai. Toyai. I too yika, Palanga. I too yika. Palono, the man la. Nakoipo. Lima. Holo. Holo. Lalo. What's that all about? I think we're being blamed for something. Probably that volcanic rumble. Holo. Holo. Lalo. Yona. You're behind us, Harrison. Tell them we're friends or you'll stop the first bullet. me with you, they'll kill me. That's what you deserve. We may have some use for him. Keep him covered, Pencroft. If they charge us, fire a shot over their heads. What's up, Roy? We're too scared of our guns to try following us. You owe us a debt for saving your life, Harrison. It's only fair that you pay up. But I have no money. Our price is information. Where can we find a boat? We want to leave this island. I did too once, but I gave it up. You see, there are no boats. And there must be something, some way to leave this place. If there was, I would have found it many years ago. You see, this island is off the shipping lanes. No one ever comes here, so there is no chance for anyone to leave. Can I go now? Not yet. Who are those people we just left? I found them here when I came. They told me they were inside the island when it rose up from the sea, and the volcano freed them. But there are other people on the island. Who's the mystery man? Mystery man? Yes, we've seen signs of him around here. He leaves a trail of large shoe prints deeply embedded. Oh, yes, I've seen him. Where can we find him? You can't. He comes and goes like a ghost. Where'd you see him? I followed him to a cave in those mountains near the beach. Let's have a look. Where's Ayrton? 
He ran out on us. He couldn't have gone far. Never mind him. We've something more important to think about. This may be it. going to return to Mysterious Island? What will they do when they learn that the castaways have found their supplies? See what happens in The Pirates Attack, Chapter 6 of Mysterious Island, at this theater next week. Castaways persuade Ayrton to show them the location of the mystery man's cave. Ayrton vanishes mysteriously, but the others go to the cave, hoping to find help to leave the island. Still in one piece, if that's what you mean. So am I. What do you suppose we ran into? Nothing I could explain, lad. All I saw was a blinding shower of sparks. Same here. Whatever it was seemed to come from openings within these walls. Whoever you are, listen closely. What you have just experienced is merely a warning. I mean you no harm. But you must leave at once. Where's that voice coming from? It seems to be all around us. Do not attempt to find me. Get out. Maybe it's Ayrton. He steered us here. No, Ayrton isn't clever enough to arrange all this. Our mystery man is around here somewhere. He's giving us another sample of his magic. Leave here while you can. Refuse, and I shall not be responsible for what happens. That does it. Let's get out of here. No one here. We're up against someone more ingenious than we think. Let's get back to the hut. Well, after what happened at that cave, it doesn't look like we can count on much help from our mystery man. 
Does that mean we're to stay marooned here forever, Captain? I hope not, Gideon. For the time being, we'll have to learn to live on this island and like it. I'll live on it, all right. But I'm hanged if I'll like it. I'd like it a lot better after a night's sleep. Me too. You're right. Good night's sleep will do us all good. Taking me. Launch the boat. Caught him spying on us when we were filling our water casks. The captain may find some use for him. Captain Shard. It's me, Ayrton. Don't you know me? Who would want to know you? Take a good look at him, Molly. It's Ayrton, your former shipmate. The years spent here don't improve his appearance any. <laughs> but you're going to take me away with you, Captain. You promised, Captain Shard, that on your next trip you... You are banished for disobeying my orders. I'll decide when your term of punishment is over. Then why have you returned to the island? Because I need provisions from our stores. If you can get them. What do you mean? They're still there, aren't they? Yes. They're all here, Captain, and more, too. What else? Five survivors who landed here in a wrecked balloon during a storm. They've taken over the stores you've left. Uh, five castaways are hardly a match for us. Oh, but they're well armed. They can be counted on to resist. There are ways of luring them out into the open, where they can be wiped out. How can you do that? By using you as bait. <laughs> what do we do with him, Captain Shot? Throw him in the brig, Molly. Nothing like a good meal to start the day off right. <laughs> we just naturally picked the best dock place on the island. <laughs> Even Top is voicing his approval. <laughs> Not the way he's but something's wrong. <laughs> What is it, Top? What do you see? It's Ayrton. He seems to be hurt. Our rifles are back at the hut. Back to the hut. <laughs> 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 what a 
invited guest. Let's show him a good time. I saw them on the island before. Probably a landing party from some ship. Pirate ship, judging from their dress and manner. What do you suppose they want of us, Hardy? This cave we found might be their storehouse. So it's ours now? Yes, but for how long? Our ammunition is limited. They must know it. You and the others hold them off till I get back. I'm going after that mystery man. No, he won't help us. That voice in the cave warned us away. He's helped us before. He just doesn't want us to track him down. Let me go. I'm smaller than he is. I can work my way along the face of the cliff to the next ledge. Go ahead, Bert. We'll keep the pirates' heads down. to stop firing. Let them have it. We'll never get them out of there unless we rush them. That's not the way. I got a better idea. Keep busy.
Where did that come from? From amongst our emergency supplies in the boat. You know what to do. Longer. Bert might be back soon with help. from Mercury make a prisoner of Bert? With whom have the pirates gone to war? For the amazing answers, see Menace of the Mercurians, Chapter 7 of Mysterious Island, at this theater next week. returned to the island to get supplies they left there. Finding the castaways have taken over their quarters, the pirates attack. Our ammunition can't hold out much longer. Bert might be back soon with help. You saw that powder keg, Mr. Gideon. Yeah, it's a miracle we're alive. Well, I hope the blast drove the pirates off. Pirates? I'd like to forget about them. They haven't forgot about us.
door was sealed. It was. Well, it just didn't open and close by itself. It must have accidentally touched some hidden spring. Two of them escaped, Captain Shard. Yes, thanks to your clumsiness. But these two didn't. Now we can settle with them for helping themselves to our stores. Now, wait. There's a more practical way to make them pay. Take them out to the ship. There's always work for slaves to do. <laughs> Come on, men. Someone must have helped us escape. Remember, there's a mystery man on the island. Well, there's nobody here now. He must have used this passage. We'll follow it and see where it leads. There might still be time to help Jack Pencroft and Mr. Gideon. Yes, yeah, so in the meantime, we'll try and locate Bert and try to warn him what's happened. Me. Why not? You've already tried to kill me. Not kill. I was warning you, Earthman. Earthman? Who are you? My name is Rulu. I'm from the planet Mercury. But you speak English. We've mastered all of Earth's languages. Well, what are you doing here and how did you come? How we came is my secret. We're in search of a substance found only on Earth. Then go ahead and search. All I want is to get out of here. You will come with me. What makes you think I will? I know you will. You will follow me quietly and make no attempt to escape. Do you understand? Yes. I've never seen this place before. This island is full of surprises. Don't see any signs of that mystery man, though. Did you hear anything? <laughs> Something's coming out of that brush, Captain Hart. Hey, it's Top. Hiya, Top. Hiya. Hiya. Say, I think he wants us to follow him. didn't kill him after all. No. If they get him aboard their ship, there's no telling what'll happen. Well, can we help before they get there? We can try. Get over there. 
Let's finish them off. Not till they've learned what it means to be slaves aboard a pirate ship. Tie them up. mystery friend has saved us. Yes, but we can't always count on him. From now on, we'll have to ship for ourselves. There's still food and water in the cave. Unless the pirates have taken it. We've found no trace of Bert. You wait here and rest a while. I'll go scouting and see what the pirates are up to. Let me go with you. Come on. Take your men to the ship and get things ready. Tell the guards we'll load the supplies tonight and get away from this cursed place. Aren't you coming with us? No. I'll meet you here tonight. Now get on your way. Come on, men. Well, they're up to something. Get Pencroft and Gideon. I'll stay here and keep an eye on Shard. Paid off. I wonder what they're up to. Where's Molly? Stayed aboard ship, sir. He said he wasn't feeling well. Well, I'll attend to him later. You two go back and stand by the boat. The rest of you follow me. Say, that gives me a great idea. What is it? We'll follow those two back to their boat. Once we take that ship, we can control the island. Then we can get Bert and sail away. I'm for it.
Shot wouldn't let me have my way with you. But now, he's not aboard. What are you gonna do with us? See you to your boat, of course. Over the side with him. Cannon for firing. to Bert, a prisoner of the Mercurians. At whom is this pirate attack directed? Be sure to see Between Two Fires, Chapter 8 of Mysterious Island, at this theater next week.